What if I shared with you that the answers to nearly every challenge a person encounters can be found in teachings from over two millennia ago? Welcome back to our channel, where today we're delving beyond philosophy to uncover life-altering insights. In this journey, we're revealing ten timeless Stoic lessons that many men often realize too late. These lessons aren't merely abstract philosophical ideas. They are practical tools for addressing life's toughest hurdles, ranging from mastering emotions to navigating change and understanding the true nature of success. Stick with us until the end, as each lesson carries equal significance. And the final one might be the most unexpected and transformative of all. An overlooked lesson that could change your perspective on everything. Whether you're seeking answers, growth, or a fresh outlook on life, you're in the right place. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. You wouldn't want to miss this enlightening journey. Accepting's off with lesson, with lesson accepting what you cannot control. Let's transport ourselves back to ancient Rome where Stoicism thrived. Philosophers like Seneca and Marcus Aurelius recognized the futility of worrying about life's uncontrollables. They taught that while we can't dictate the weather, halt time, or control others' actions, we can master our reactions, thoughts, and decisions. Fast forward to today, and this lesson remains just as relevant in our hyper-connected world, bombarded with information and endless expectations. Knowing what we can and cannot control is not just wisdom. It's a survival skill. How can we apply this ancient wisdom in our modern lives? It begins with a simple yet profound shift in perspective. When faced with a challenging situation, ask yourself, is this within my control? If not, imagine placing it in a balloon and letting it drift away into the sky. This mental practice isn't about giving up. It's about investing your energy wisely. It's choosing to nurture your garden rather than trying to stop the rain. I recall a time when stuck in traffic, anxious and frustrated about an important meeting. It dawned on me that I couldn't control the traffic, but I could control my reaction. So I took a deep breath, turned on some soothing music and used that time to mentally prepare for the meeting. The result? I arrived calm and centered, turning what could have been a stressful ordeal into a moment of peace. The Power of Perspective Stoicism teaches us that it's not the events themselves that disturb us, but our interpretation of these events. Picture two men caught in a downpour. One curses the rain, while the other relishes the soothing sound of raindrops. Same event, different perspectives. Stoic philosophers, like Epictetus, emphasize that we have the power to choose our perspective. It's not what happens to you, but how you react to it that matters. This wisdom is timeless, especially in our world filled with unforeseen challenges and rapid changes. The capacity to adjust our viewpoint is not only useful, it is also necessary for preserving mental tranquility and resilience. How can we use this power in our everyday lives? It starts with a conscious pause. When faced with a challenge, take a step back and ask yourself, is there another way to look at this? Similar to a photographer seeking the best angle for a shot, we can look for a more empowering viewpoint. For instance, seeing a job loss not as a failure but as an opportunity to pursue a passion or learn new skills. This shift in perspective can transform obstacles into stepping stones. Living in the present is a core tenet of Stoicism, urging us to ground ourselves in the here and now. The present moment is where life unfolds, joy is experienced, and peace is discovered. A lesson often realized belatedly when reflecting on missed opportunities due to not being fully present. Ancient Stoics, like Marcus Aurelius, acknowledged the transience of time. Understanding that fixating on the past or obsessing about the future is akin to trying to grasp water. It's futile and leaves you empty-handed. Aurelius advised against wasting life in thoughts about others and emphasized contentment with the present. In today's fast-paced world, where minds are frequently elsewhere, embracing mindfulness becomes crucial. Mindfulness involves fully engaging in the current activity, free from distractions or judgments. Whether savoring morning coffee, immersing in a conversation, or feeling the warmth of the sun, being present gives us the experience of life unfolding in its full richness and beauty. Moving on to Lesson 4, a self-discipline and integrity. In a world teeming with temptations and shortcuts, Stoicism calls us to a higher standard, to master ourselves. 
This mastery isn't about restriction, but liberation, exercising self-control and aligning actions with core values. During the Vathlactine, Stoics understood that enduring happiness lies in cultivating inner virtues, not in external accolades. In today's context where distractions are a click away and ethical challenges abound, the need for self-discipline and integrity is we weave these virtues into our lives through small, consistent actions. Waking up early for a morning run, choosing a nutritious meal over a tempting one, and making decisions aligned with values, even when not the easiest. Of these moments of discipline and integrity accumulate, building a life of strength, character, and fulfillment. Lesson 5 involves embracing change. While many resist or fear change, Stoicism invites us to see it as a lens of growth and opportunity. Change is not only inevitable but also fertile ground for new opportunities to sprout. Stoics like Marcus Aurelius and Seneca observed the relentless tide of change in seasons and empires. Stoicism doesn't just ask us to accept change. It urges us to welcome it as an old friend, knowing it brings seeds of new. Practically, embracing change means viewing every shift, whether minor or monumental, as an opportunity for self-discovery and development. It's finding the silver lining in unexpected situations, turning job loss into a chance to pursue passion, and ending a relationship into an opportunity to rediscover individual strengths and desires. Lesson 6 addresses the futility of material pursuits. In a world associating success with material wealth and status, Stoicism provides a counter-narrative. True, lasting happiness doesn't come from accumulating possessions or accolades, but from cultivating inner richness. The Stoic philosophers, from Seneca to Epictetus, understood the fleeting nature of material wealth. Despite the societal pressure to acquire more, Stoicism encourages finding contentment in simplicity and self-sufficiency. Applying this lesson involves shifting focus from external acquisition to internal development, cherishing experiences over possessions, and measuring success by the quality of character and relationships. While material possessions offer temporary pleasure, lasting fulfillment arises from inner peace, purpose, and connection with others and seven focuses on managing emotions. Contrary to common belief, Stoicism does not advocate for the expression of emotions but instead teaches the art of understanding and navigating them effectively. This crucial lesson, often realized belatedly, emphasizes that mastering emotions is not about denying them but acknowledging, understanding and guiding them in constructive ways. Stoics, with their profound understanding of human nature, acknowledged emotions as an integral part of our existence. However, they also recognized the turmoil unmanaged emotions could cause. Philosophers like Seneca and Marcus Aurelius advised against being swayed by the tempest of feelings and encouraged standing firm, understanding their nature and impact. In today's fast-paced and stressful world, this stoic approach to emotions is not just wise but necessary. It teaches us to respond to life's ups and downs with equanimity and clarity. Practicing this lesson in daily life begins with self-awareness, recognizing and naming emotions, understanding their triggers. This awareness is the first step toward managing emotions. Instead of reacting impulsively, pause and consider a response aligned with values and goals. Techniques like deep breathing, journaling, or engaging in open conversations can be powerful tools in processing and understanding emotions. Lesson 9 underscores the value of wisdom and knowledge. The great Stoic philosophers, from Marcus Aurelius to Seneca, were avid learners and keen observers of life. They considered wisdom the highest virtue, a guiding beacon through life's tumultuous seas. Aurelius, in his meditations, continually sought to understand the world and his place in it, using knowledge as a tool for personal betterment and societal contribution. In our current era, where information is abundant yet true wisdom is scarce, the Stoic emphasis on discerning knowledge and reflective learning is more pertinent than ever. Incorporating this lesson into our lives means fostering a mindset of curiosity and an appetite for learning. It's about embracing the joy of discovering new ideas, reflecting on experiences, and seeking deeper understanding. Whether through books, nature, art, or conversations, every moment holds the potential for learning. Wisdom is not solely about intellectual pursuits, it's about applying what we learn to become better human beings. Lesson 10 explores the strength found in forgiveness. 
Stoicism teaches us that holding on to grudges and resentment is akin to carrying a heavy burden, hindering our journey towards tranquility and happiness. Many realize too late in life that forgiveness is not an act of weakness, but a profound display of strength and a pathway to inner peace. The Stoics, recognizing the corrosive effect of anger and resentment on the soul, emphasize the importance of letting go of bitterness, not for the sake of others, but for our own well-being. Marcus Aurelius once said, the best revenge is to be unlike him who performed the injustice. In today's world, where grudges can be long held and forgiveness is often seen as surrender, the stoic wisdom of forgiveness stands as a beacon of enlightened self-interest and emotional maturity. Embracing forgiveness in our daily lives means recognizing that every person, including ourselves, is fallible and capable of making mistakes. It's about understanding that forgiveness frees us from the chains of bitterness and allows us to move forward with our whether forgiving a friend who wronged us, a colleague who made a mistake, or even ourselves for our own errors. Each act of forgiveness strengthens our character and deepens our capacity for compassion and understanding. Decisism offers timeless wisdom that can guide us through life's challenges. These ten lessons can lead to a more fulfilling, balanced life. If you find other Stoic principles valuable, share them in the comments below. If you found this video insightful, please like, share and subscribe for more content like this. Until next time, keep growing and stay Stoic. Stoicism, a philosophical school of thought that originated in ancient Greece, has experienced a resurgence in popularity in recent times due to its timeless wisdom and practicality. While Stoic philosophy provides profound insights, its true transformative power lies in its practical application in our daily lives. In this essay, we will explore how individuals can actively integrate Stoic principles into their routines, fostering a more balanced and resilient approach to life. No choosing Stoic practices embark on a stoic journey, individuals must first select practices that resonate with their personal goals and challenges. Whether it's mindfulness, acceptance, or the focus on what's within one's control, the key is to choose practices that align with individual values and aspirations. Morning Routine A strategic starting point for the practical application of stoicism is integrating it into one's morning routine. Begin the day with a moment of reflection, contemplating what aspects are within your control and what are not. This practice sets the tone for the day, encouraging individuals to set intentions aligned with stoic principles of acceptance and resilience. Mindful awareness throughout the day. Mindfulness, a cornerstone of stoic philosophy, plays a pivotal role in navigating life with clarity and equanimity. As individuals go about their day, the practice of mindful awareness becomes a powerful tool, from savoring the morning coffee to fully engaging in a conversation or focusing on a task. Mindfulness anchors individuals in the present moment. No to bien. The art of journaling serves as another practical application of Stoicism. Taking a few minutes each day to reflect on experiences, challenges faced, and emotional responses provides individuals with valuable insights. Journaling not only enhances self-awareness but also serves as a tangible record of Stoic practices in action. Evening Reflection As the day concludes, engaging in an evening reflection becomes a crucial component of applying Stoic principles. Individuals can review their actions and reactions, assessing how well they embodied stoic virtues such as wisdom, courage, justice, and temperance. This reflective practice not only serves as a form of self-accountability, but also prepares individuals for the challenges of the next day, fostering a continuous cycle of growth. Challenges and Rewards of Practicing Stoicis while the benefits of incorporating Stoic practices into daily life are numerous, challenges may arise. The fast-paced nature of modern living, external pressures and ingrained habits can pose obstacles to the consistent application of Stoicism. However, it's essential to recognize that perfection is not the goal. Progress is Rester in success declusion in conclusion, embracing Stoicism in everyday living is not merely an intellectual exercise, but a transformative journey.
It's a practical application of Stoic principles, from morning reflections to evening contemplation, offers individuals a roadmap to navigate life's challenges with resilience and clarity. As we integrate these practices into our routines, we cultivate a more balanced and stoic way of living, contributing not only to our personal well-being but also to a society that can benefit from the wisdom of the ancients. So, let us embark on this journey of self-discovery and growth, keeping in mind the enduring relevance of stoicism in our contemporary lives.